All right, today's video we are going to solve a question square root of x over x equal to a 5. Okay, then solution. By copy what we have, we have square root of x over x equal to a 5. Okay. Now, we know that when we have square root, we mean that you have x power 1 over a 2. Okay? And of course, down here we have x equal to a 5. And we know that here, if you write x power 1 over a 2 over x we know that x has power of one that is what we call invisible power okay then equal to a five okay and by using low row of indices which says that a power n over a power m once you have same base this is equal to a power n minus m and this is what we are going to apply it here, okay? Then we shall say x power 1 over a 2 minus a 1 equal to a 5, okay? To mean that x power 1 over 2 minus 1, this is equal to negative 1 over a 2, okay? Which equal to a 5, okay? Then after, if you have a number with which it says that a power negative n, this is equal to 1 over a power n. Okay? Then, what we have, we have 1 over x power 1 over a 2 equal to a 5. Then here we can say simply say 1 over square root of x equal to a 5. Okay, now here by cross multiplication 1 equal to square root of x then times a 5. Okay, or we can simply write 1 equal to 5 square root of x okay then next we, we shall square them to get 1 equal to 25 x okay by divide 25 divide 25 we shall write that x equal to 1 over 20 as final solution okay but you have to check always check if the answer you have got if it is correct okay then right here we have given that square root of x over x equal to a 5 and we know x is 1 over 25 we shall say square root of 1 over 25 over 1 over 25 equal to a 5 question mark. And then right here we are going to separate this one inside square root to get square root of 1 over square root of 25. Okay. Then after over. 1 over 25 equal to a 5. Okay? Then this is equal to 1 over a 5 times 20. 25 over a 1 which equal to 25. Question mark. Okay? This is equal to 25 by simplify. We shall get 
one right here and a five okay so that right here we shall say five equal to a five then the left hand side equals to right hand side okay then our solution is correct thanks for watching don't forget to share and subscribe